Hi guys, you're with Kirk here at Kirk's No BS Fitness Channel. Um, firstly, I just want to say thank you so much for everybody who subscribed, for leaving all the positive comments, um, encouragement. Like, I really like thank you so much. I didn't expect to get such positive feedback so far. So, really, thank you. Um, secondly, I just want to touch base on the comments been fantastic heaps of comments heaps of questions they're coming at me hard and fast these questions guys I'm, I'm I promise I'm gonna try and answer as many as I can I'm, I'm trying to answer you on the comments I'm gonna make videos about them as much as I can but there's a lot of them and I'm just like one little person with a laptop so stick with me if I haven't got your questions already I promise I'm working my way through there'll either be a video coming up about it or there will be a response I haven't ignored it I'm trying the best I can guys what I want to cover today, guys, is feeling intimidated to go to the gym. So I had a fair few comments, actually, um, based around the same thing. So for various reasons, people were feeling intimidated to go to the gym. It might have been, um, you know, you're a little bit heavier than you'd like to be. Um, yeah, you're a little bit skinnier than you want to be, and you want to be a little bit musclier before you go to the gym. Now, first, what I'm going to say to you guys is I totally get it. I 100%, 100% get it. Um, I still remember the first time I went to the gym, I looked in there, and I thought two things, I was like, holy shit, that's a, that's a lot of big dudes. And the second thing I thought was, oh crap, that's a lot of equipment that I don't know how to use. As far as not feeling intimidated and getting over that, now, you're probably not going to like this answer, but you just got to do it. Um, you just got to get in there and you got to give it a go. Now, the first time you go into the gym, it's going to be a little bit intimidating. Um, it, it just is. It's the first time you're going to do something. So it's going to be a little bit intimidating. Couple of things you can do to help yourself though. Um, get educated. So learn a little bit about the gym, a um, little bit about training. If you can find someone to go with you, that's always a great way to do it. You're a little buddy with you, um, someone who's been training for a while, or even just a friend that can go down. So, you know, safety in numbers, you feel a little bit better that way. So if you've got a friend that can go with you, that'd be fantastic. I'd also suggest researching the gym before you go there. So go around, have a look at a few different gyms. Um, there'll be some gyms that you go to that you'll just get a really good feel about it. You're like, yeah, this is this is the gym for me. I, I feel like I could, you know, do a bit here. There'll be other gyms you're like, nah, don't like it, uncomfortable. So, you know, go around to a few different uh, gyms and just see how you feel. So the reason I'm filming this in my car, guys, is I'm actually on the way to my gym where I train. So I'm going to do a bit of a workout. But what I thought I'd do um, on the whole intimidating thing is I'm going to get the owner of the gym I train at on camera to have a bit of a talk. Now, he can be quite an intimidating guy. He's a big, strong dude, um, shaved head. He's got tattoos on his head. So he can be an intimidating guy. So uh, people being intimidated, this has been something he's, he's quite used to. So I thought it would be nice to get his take on... Um, people being intimidated by the gym and what he recommends to get over that. Hey okay, people, this is the man I was talking about. This is Rodney Brabus. He's the owner of Sale Health and Fitness and he's also the only guy I've let train me in about the last five years. So let's get straight to the question. If you had someone who was intimidated, um, wasn't sure about uh, joining the gym, what advice would you give them? Well, first of all, I'd say go and approach the gym, okay? What we'll do here is we'll normally get them to have a look at the gym when it's nice and quiet and reassure them that we're, we already have their respect for coming through the door and making an effort to, to change their lives to be, be fit people. Absolutely. Apologise for the um segment with Rod being so short, but he sort of did me a bit of a favor. I caught him in between sets. He was super busy. He was trying to get his workout in before his next appointment. So big shout out to Rod. Really appreciate the time. So just to wrap up guys, I think Rod probably had one of the best points of all, and that was scope out a gym, get a training partner, but call the gym before you head down there. Make an appointment so they're expecting you, so you don't just walk in there and, and they don't really have time for you. So call them before you get there. They'll have a bit of time for you. Try and make an appointment for a quiet time and take a friend with you if you can. Okay guys, I hope this stuff was helpful for you. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, make sure you do. I'll catch you guys later.